Section 43 of Poems by Kerr, Ellis, and Acton Bell by Charlotte, Emily, and Anne Bronte. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Vanitas Vanitatum Omnia Vanitas by Anne Bronte In all we do and hear and see is restless toil and vanity. While yet the rolling earth abides, men come and go like ocean tides. And ere one generation dies, another in its place shall rise. That, sinking soon into the grave, others succeed like wave on wave. And as they rise, they pass away, the sun rises every day. And hastening onward to the west, he nightly sinks, but not to rest. Returning to the eastern skies, again to light us he must rise. And still the restless wind comes forth, now blowing keenly from the north. Now from the south, the east, the west, forever changing, ne'er at rest. The fountains gushing from the hills supply the ever-running rills. The thirsty rivers drink their store and bear it rolling to the shore. But still the ocean craves for more. Tis endless labor everywhere. Sound cannot satisfy the ear. Light cannot fill the craving eye, Nor riches half our wants supply. Pleasure but doubles future pain, And joy brings sorrow in her train. Laughter is mad and reckless mirth. What does she in this weary earth? Should wealth or fame our life employ, Death comes our labor to destroy, To snatch the untasted cup away, For which we toiled so many a day. What then remains for wretched man, To use life's comforts while he can? Enjoy the blessings heaven bestows, Assist his friends, forgive his foes, Trust God, and keep his statues still, Upright and firm through good and ill. Thankful for all that God has given, Fixing his firmest hopes on heaven, Knowing that earthly joys decay, But hoping through the darkest day. End of section 43